It's, it's two, two for Tuesday. Tuesday. Looks like you could use a hand or maybe an extra pair of hands. Yeah, I'm trying to wire my project using Wago's Top Job S terminal blocks, and I have to use tools for the push buttons and open tool slots. That's understandable, but why use the different size tools? Can't you just use one tool for all the slots? Unfortunately, no. It all depends on the wire gauge. Any terminal block, like this one, that takes over 12 gauge wire, needs this medium sized tool. Anything under 12 gauge, like this block or the Top Job S Mini, needs a smaller tool like this one. You don't need an extra hand, you need a tool, and I have just the thing. This two-sided angle mini screwdriver from Wago should do the trick. This is awesome. Both the small and medium tool in one. Now I don't have to keep going back and forth. Not only that, but the angled head allows for more space and better sight lines when wiring your terminal block. See? Now I don't have to search for multiple tools. But what about if I have a large gauge wire that has bigger tool slot like this Top Job S? Wago has you covered there too. They also have a tool with the large end and the medium on the other covering the entire range of products. So realistically, when wiring using Wago's Top Job S terminal blocks, I only need two tools? Yeah, so not only do you save space in the cabinet with Wago's Top Job S terminal blocks, but I also save space in my toolbox. And that makes it a fantastic Two, two for, for Tuesday. Tuesday. Go to www.wago.com slash us slash top job s to discover all of our top job s rail mount terminal block options with all three variants. And to find out more about our tools, go to www.wago.com backslash us backslash discover dash tools and scroll down to the operating tools to see which one is right for you. Happy Tuesday.